What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Brutal Planet Comics. I'm your host, Dre the Brute Daniels. I'm here with some more news. Well, I thought I was done talking about this story, but apparently not. This girl, Frost Curran, is the most delusional human being I think I have laid my eyes on in quite some time. So, here's this article, um, apparently. Frost Curran calls out G4 TV for failing to support her. What? After backlash over sexism in gaming segment. The delusion of this person. They failed to support you. They let you do the segment. You went off the freaking rails and they immediately didn't can you and literally sacrificed their entire company because of it. But they didn't support you. You're delusional. You are sick up here. So let's look, through, let's look at this article a little bit here. So G4 has been shut down. That's the truth. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, they shut that chunk down like an FBI raid. Holy crap. So, including Frost, after she bragged about not being fired. This is, this is, this is some type of, she's sick. So, they go on to quote what she said. I'm not going to say all of it because I will be demonetized. So, it says, it has somehow become acceptable that you can talk about how much you do a certain behavior towards a woman as a compliment it's dehumanizing and it's weird women do not exist to be nice in the eyes for you olivia munn didn't exist to be nice in the eyes for you this is what she said i think this was back in january which is not correct olivia munn did uh what's that what, what's the term they use attract the male gaze or whatever the case may be because she was hot it's reality she also knew what she was talking about though Olivia Munn was brains and brawn. Brains and beauty. Brains and beauty. Brain, brains and problem. That's all. Brains and beauty. You ain't. <laughs> but let's let's get let's get down to the nitty gritty. Ross reveals frustration with G4 management. Now though, this is where things get interesting. So she is claiming that she has not gotten support. She says, asked for support multiple times, was ignored. Or directly lied to about support coming no guidelines no plans no help the management changed and it became openly hostile they became openly hostile because we were they were losing all of their viewership and their money because of you and your narcissism and your extremely crazy rant so I, let's break down this tweet my sexism and gaming segment was approved by all executive showrunners in x-play when i was originally hired and cast g4 made the internal statement that diversity and inclusion was what it was built on to fix the past. Whatever that means. I was fully supported initially until doxing slash threats. Let me tell you why they dropped support for you. First of all, this tweet is nonsense. They dropped support for you because let's say that they approved the segment. And I believe they did. I'm pretty sure you went completely off the rails on what they intended for you to say. I promise you. I'm pretty sure you telling the audience to not watch was not part of the script. I promise you that. They started losing viewership and money. So yeah, they're going to be hostile because you have literally took money out their pockets. And now the company is completely destroyed. So all this nonsense, oh, they didn't support me. They supported you all the way to the point that the company died. You are delusional. Get help. This narcissistic attitude that you have, and, and you need help. You got free time now. You fired. <laughs> but seriously, this is nonsense. This is garbage. Um, talking about ain't nobody help you. You're insane. And the whole statement of diversity and inclusion, first of all, the way you used it as a weapon. Let's just let's call it like it is. You use it as a weapon to attack your paying and or viewing customers. I promise you, G4 didn't want that. So this whole delusion of nobody supported me. You're an idiot. Get over yourself. It's over. And hopefully I ain't got to talk about this stuff no more. <laughs> so guys, what do you think about 
Frost Lunacy. Let me know in the comments section below. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And when you subscribe, don't forget to press the little bell and share the video. As always, you've been awesome, and I'll catch you all next time. Also, if you want to support my channel, uh, check out SpinWiz.com or download the SpinWiz app and check out my comic series, Trouble. It was written with a lot of love, and it was definitely my favorite comic series to write. I've also written it in English and in Spanish, so whatever floats your boat, I got it for you. Thanks again, and check it out.